All right, Patrick. Oh, uh, number six, having a tough time lately. Try listening to birds. Oh. Happiness scientists in London say those chirping noises can actually improve uh, mental health, which is why we let one in the building a week or two ago to fly around the newsroom. Uh, it reminds people of nature and being outdoors, and that can help with depression and anxiety. Uh, you don't have to listen to the birds either. You can download bird noises and listen to them anytime you feel like it to see if you feel better. You can read more about the bird study in scientific reports. Uh, it's a it's a great read. Okay. Uh, one quick trip to the bathroom. I think you can knock out the whole article. Huh. Huh. And uh, you'll be better off for it. Thank you, right. Patrick. Yeah. Thanks, Patrick. All right, number five. I'm really into Dutch ovens right now. How does your wife feel about that? Uh, well, she... <laughs> I love the idea of a Dutch oven. I just can't get enough of it. Yeah. Um, love to tell you more. Uh, and I imagine I will here in just a second. Uh, but my latest obsess, campfire quiche. Oh. Uh, yeah. You can own your own uh, favorites, uh, or add your own favorites like uh, sausage, onions, cheddar cheese, and some garlic, and then top them off with a dozen eggs and let the hot coals do all mm. the work. Now you're gonna wanna keep in mind that this is done on an open campfire, all right? The, and uh, hence the name. So it's more than likely uh, a weekend thing. But you also have to bake your own quiche by putting your Dutch oven in the oven. Uh, I've got a, I know I this confused. sounds very confusing yeah, to you're you, confusing oven, me. which is why I've done a tutorial on my YouTube channel called Campfire Quiche. Uh, that's going to be today at three, and that's with two mm. silent K's. Huh. Campfire Quiche. The, the si second silent K is on fire. Uh. <laughs> for clearing. Gotcha. Yeah. Okay, because I did hear a couple of them, but yeah. some of them That's were silent. Okay. Word fire. Uh, number four, it's Throwback uh, Tuesday. <laughs> what? Didn't know that was a thing. Let's go Throwback way back Tuesday. to 1971. Do you remember Weebles? Oh, I do. They were around happy little toy uh, figures uh, that came with play sets. They were a big deal back then with the popular tagline, Weebles, Weebles wobble, wobble, but, but they, they don't, don't fall down. down. Weebles wobble, but they don't fall down. Put them in their car and camper, you can mm. take them all around. Look at them weebles wobble. Weebles wobble in the camper, weebles wobble on the ground. Weebles will wobble anywhere you put them, but you can't keep a weeble down. Weebles wobble, but they don't fall down. Mm. Car, camper, furniture, boat, bike, and four weebles from Romper Room. Wobble, baby, wobble, baby, wobble, baby. <laughs> oh, is that what inspired this song? I never realized that. I didn't that. know that either. All right, number three. Parts of the Great Smoky Mountains National Park are closed right now due to black bears feeding in the area. Oh. They're preparing for hibernation. Right. Park officials closed off several trails to allow the bears to feed on as many acorns as they need undisturbed as they prepare for their winter slumber. Mm -hmm. About 1,500 bears live in the park, and many of them can weigh more than 600 pounds right now. Officials say the closures are meant to keep both the bears and the humans safe, so mm. stay out. Nice. Mm-hmm. All right, number two, uh, for the person who has everything, how about taking them on a 12-day private jet tour of Europe? Oh. High-end tour operator Red Savannah will take 15 people to Croatia, the Greek islands, Italy, and London in high style. You'll be on a luxury airliner. You'll stay at five-star hotels with personal chefs. You'll also get personal guided tours and private cocktail receptions. Uh, the price? Uh, only around $140,000 per person. Nice. Uh, the tour takes off September 12th, 2023. Uh, but here's the best part. A portion of the price will be donated to the Rainforest Trust ah, Fund. There you are. So if you were on the fence about it, I imagine <laughs> yeah. that just kicked you right off yeah. uh, to, to try and offset the trip's carbon emissions. Yeah, if you mean. were try, you're yeah. not going to come close. No. But you're going to uh -huh. try. Isn't that nice? All right, number one, are you down with the DOP? 
Uh, you know me, Larry. Uh, yeah. DOP says for dress over pants. Oh. The trend is putting a cute uh. dress over some pants or some jeans, and it's back in the major way right now. Uh, there's a bit of a difference this time around, though. Uh, play with shapes. Add a wide uh, leg pant under a pencil skirt. Uh, turn up the volume. Be ready to bring your fun. You're going to mix your colors. You're going to add a wedge heel. And uh, don't forget to tag me in your photos. And uh, you can look for my TikTok tutorial this Friday. Uh, that's like three or four <laughs> days from now. Uh, at 9 a.m. Mountain Time. Ooh, but 3 p.m. today is the, uh, is the, the YouTube, tutorial. yeah, quiche. Uh, Dutch oven. Uh, yeah, Dutch okay. oven. So, uh, okay. Well, Does thanks for that. Yeah. Does anybody live in Mountain Time? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I believe so. Is that time zone? <laughs> anybody band. live there? Kankakee, yeah. I think, is yeah. Mountain Time. Yeah, part of the western parts of our view. Well, yeah. there we go. That's the six yeah. and six. All right.